Hi, it's Jamie. Welcome to the first ever Friday Night Live, where tonight is all about having faith over fear. Um, I'm broadcasting from my studio in Nashville, Tennessee. Tonight's going to be a short but hopefully great time of just encouraging one another with all that's happening in our world right now. And guys, if you're just joining, welcome. Um, please say hi in the comments. Let us know where you are, how we can pray for you. The power of prayer, the power of prayer is so important at this time. I'm excited um, to get into that tonight. We need each other and I believe that when we pray, God hears our prayers and he answers them. And I don't know if like me, you've been following the news, but it, and that's good to do because it keeps us informed as to what's happening, but too much of it. And it can be overwhelming and discouraging, can't it? It's really easy to forget that there's power in the name of Jesus that we have a God that cares for us. He will take care of us. He's never let us down yet. Um, as Jerry Bridges, uh, the late Jerry Bridges used to say, our God is perfectly loving, infinitely wise, and completely sovereign. And I think that's true. Um, listen to this, guys, from Hebrews chapter 10, just before I start this first song. Therefore, let us hold unswervingly to the hope we profess, for he who promised is faithful. Amen. This is prize worth fighting for. Welcome. Thanks for joining. Lately, been down so low. My faith seems to come and go. Some days, Father, I don't know. How did my love won't call? Guys, welcome. 
Amen. Thank you so much for joining in tonight. And if you've just joined, leave a comment and let us know where you are. It's great to have you. Um, friends, this coronavirus has been crazy and it's been making people crazy as well. I The other day, I finally decided, you know what, I'm going to have to go to the shops and uh, get some pandemic basics, you know. And so I got up 5.30 in the morning. Anybody that knows me knows that 5.30 is a ridiculous time for me to get up. So I arrive at Kroger's at six o'clock and I kid you not, I was, I was in the bread aisle for three minutes past six. I checked my watch, not a crumb left, completely gone. Made my way over to the uh, toilet paper with, with that, that aisle. Four minutes past six, a minute later, completely wiped out, pardon the pun. Uh, nothing left guys, People there were people fighting over bars of soap. Man, and you know, it made me think we really have a, an amazing opportunity to shine for Jesus at this time. I've been blown away to love our neighbours as well. You know, I've, be, I've really been um, amazed at the footage I've seen over the last sort of day or two of um, nurses, of public servants, doctors, uh, people working in supermarkets, just risking their own lives to serve others. And what a beautiful thing to see that love in action. And I'm, I'm convinced, guys, that's what Jesus would be doing. Uh, and we need more of that. So I think with this next song, um, let's have some fun with it. And I'm just going to have to trust that you're going to be singing along with me because you can see me, but I can't see you. It's actually, it's been a few years since, I think the last time I sang this song was when I walked in a cruise ship. So uh, there you go. All right. Love, love, love. love. I'm Jamie Kennett and you're watching Friday Night Live from my studio in Nashville, Tennessee. And as many of you guys already know, um, I haven't always been a Christian. Honestly, if coronavirus had happened 10, 11 years ago, I would have dealt with it completely differently. Um, but my faith has changed my life, friends. I can honestly say that believing in Jesus Christ, that he died on the cross for my sins, 
has changed everything. And it really has made a big difference in having hope through this crisis. See, if you're a believer, you don't have to be afraid anymore because our salvation, at least not in an ultimate sense, you know, because our salvation is not in this world, but it's in the world that's to come. And it's in the one who's defeated death and who rose again. And maybe you're watching this right now and, and you're like, well, you know, I don't know Jesus. And that's cool. If that's the case, do you know what? I'm so happy that you're here right now. And um, if that's you, then I would just encourage you. And also, if, if you're like, well, I know about Christianity, but I'm not sure where I stand with God. Um, I would just encourage you to ask him to speak to you during this next song. Ask him to reveal himself to you. Um, as I sing this song, it's all about uh, the life-changing peace and joy that fills us when we come to know Jesus. So I hope you guys enjoy this one. actually before we get into this this next song um let me grab a drink of water as well that's important stay hydrated okay so let's pray together heavenly father your word says that perfect love casts out all fear and i pray over every person watching this broadcast right now I pray, Lord, for faith and hope to fill every heart. And for those who may have this virus, Lord, we pray that you would remove sickness. We pray, Lord, that you would open up lungs, that you would breathe life now in Jesus' name. Father, as we worship you together, we proclaim that you are our King and our Saviour, and we lift up our voices. Let's lift our voices, guys. And, um, Worthy of every song we could ever sing Worthy of all the praise we could 
could ever win. Worthy of every breath we could ever breathe. We live for you. We live for you. Jesus' name above every other name. Jesus, the only one who could ever say. Worthy of every breath we could ever breathe. We live for you. Thank you for joining. Welcome. Um, yeah, keep a uh, comment below. Let us know your prayer requests as we go along. Thank you for making this just a really special time. It is better when we come together, isn't it? I live alone, and so it's a blessing. Even though I can't see you, I know that that we're here together, that we're praying, that we're seeking God. So, um, guys, listen. I know a lot of you are scared as well. I know a lot of you are worried. Um, like me, you're, you're probably concerned mostly for um, maybe o older folks, whether it's your parents, or your grandparents, or your friends, or your neighbours, um, whatever, whatever it is. But I want you to, to know something. Um, in fact, I'm going to tell you something you probably already know. But we don't hear a lot about it on the news right now. And it's this. God is still on the throne. I'll say that again. God is still on the throne. 
And our God is bigger than coronavirus. And he has a plan for all that's happening right now. Romans chapter 8 promises us that right now, in this moment, in this pandemic, God is working all things together for the good of those who love him, who are called and set apart according to his purpose. In other words, God will never let us down. He'll never leave us and he'll never forsake us. Um, In these uncertain and dangerous times, you can always be certain of this one thing. Jesus will never let you down. I hope this next song um, encourages you guys. I'm Jamie and you're watching Friday Night Live here at my studio in Nashville. Welcome. If you've just joined us, keep the prayer requests uh, coming. I've got a couple more songs uh, before we finish. So, guys, thank you for spending your Friday night with me. Um, I know that there's a lot of options. I heard that for King and Country, actually, we're playing tonight as well. And uh, probably should have switched it to Saturday, but there you go. Um, You know what? See this next song. I want to dedicate this song to those on the front lines. Um... Guys, first responders, the medical teams, the hospital staffs, nurses, doctors, um, people that work in groceries and supermarkets. These people are risking their lives across the world for others. Um, So to all of you out there um, who are doing that work, we are amazed and we're so grateful for all that you do. And um, I just I want to pray for you right now, Father. Um, we just lift up these individuals now. We pray that you would protect them from coronavirus. Lord, we pray that they would save and preserve uh, many lives um, by the work that they do, Lord. And we thank you for the goodness that is so visible um, through them at this time and how it points us to your son on the cross. Lord, we pray that you would bring healing and bring comfort um, and strength and hope to us, Lord, at this time. 
and we especially lift up those grieving um, as we bring our burdens uh, before you now. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I've got one more song for you. Um, this song has been a great reminder um, for me each day to let his light shine through me. So let's do it together and let's say uh, let's have fun with this one as we close. This
concert if you've enjoyed it or you've been encouraged please let me know maybe we can make it a regular thing and let's keep pressing on to the prize friends and I'll leave you with these words from the book of Isaiah and um, spoken by our heavenly father um, over us this is chapter 41 of verse 10 do not be afraid for I am with you do not be discouraged for I am your God I will strengthen you and help you I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. God bless guys, take care and I'll see you soon.